Learn more about being an MCCS lifeguard as we talk to lifeguards from our various pools. Also, get an in-depth look as we take you through a day in the life of an MCCS lifeguard. Then learn three tips on how to become certified with Kimberly Yamashiro from MCCS Aquatics. It's all coming up right here on Sammy on the Street, Episode 73, Lifeguard Recruitment 2013. Sammy on the street, lifeguard recruitment. Become a lifeguard with MCCS. Just like Alex, you like being a lifeguard. Yeah, I enjoy it. You, you learn so many skills and skills that give you confidence. You know, knowing that you can perform CPR anywhere, just that just gives you confidence, even if you're not at the pool. If you wanna, if you wanna get a good job and you know, have, and you're able to fulfill the duties, be a lifeguard. You get to work with a lot of great people. Everyone that works around here is very nice and friendly. You know, we're like a big family. And then I also love being part of the Marine Corps community working for MCCS. If you were talking to somebody about becoming a lifeguard, what would one of the number one things be, like when you're telling them, this is my pitch, you should be a lifeguard, why? The pay, yeah. Saving up money, especially while you're in high school, is really smart. The classes that I had to pay for, I pay for in cash for college classes. That's a lot of money. Like you have money saved up and it's also good practice saving up money and spending it wisely. Um, I'm going to school right now, I'm paying my way through on my own. How much money would you say you've saved uh, since you become a lifeguard with MCCS? Since I started lifeguarding, I've saved 12 grand. A large amount, probably $20,000 so far. But you're actually able to, to pay for your entire college degree with MCCS lifeguard pay. Yeah. Whoa, $20,000 being a lifeguard? Do you tell people about that? Oh well, yeah. So you've saved $20,000 and you're putting yourself through school at the same time. You also get uh, sick leave. Um, <clears throat> you get you get regular leave too. Yeah. A lot of people have to get scholarships. Uh, I don't have any scholarships, but I'm still able to go through school without having to take out loans. It's a lot of responsibility, but it's something everyone can do. For an 18-year-old, you have a really important job. And people's lives are in your hands. It's As much as it's a fun job, there's a serious side to it, and I think a lot of us do take pride in the fact that we're trained and we're ready to respond. You know in the back of your head you have the skills that can make everything else go smoothly in the event of an emergency. And now let's meet Janie Ishikawa, a lead lifeguard at the Camp Foster 25-meter pool. I enjoy coming in, seeing the lights go on, the, the, just the peacefulness of you know being by myself when I open, and it's definitely motivating to see people here working out at 0430 in the morning. And these are people that do have to go to work after being here and doing a workout in the morning. 10, 10, 11. Okay. I sign in so that I can um, get paid and start start on the clock. I will check the chlorine level because that's really important as a lifeguard. Um, if our chlorine is too high, then we have to actually shut the pool down so that we can maintain a safe level of um, chlorination. Pick it up, hop, hop, go, pick it up, go. Right now people are getting ready to swim with the um, Okinawa Dolphin swim team and it's the masters group and that, um, that group is led by uh, Coach Matt Luber. We just finished Masters Swimming with Coach Matt at 6.30 and we have a few uh, leftover lap swimmers that don't have to be at work for a little while so they stay here until the pool shuts down at 7 o'clock when we will be getting ready for a unit um, to come in and do some unit training and swim qualifications. So at 7 o'clock you'll see all three of us guards along with some of the Marines from the unit um, pulling out the lane lines and reorganizing the pool so that it makes it easier for the Marines to do their swim qualifications. 
And I enjoy being outside. I like doing manual labor more than sitting behind a desk or the traditional office uh, job. And so, you know, it gives me a lot of time outside in the fresh air and um, cleaning, which I, you know, I enjoy cleaning. Okay, and then we'll move down here and start with the Probably 40% of our job is cleaning. All of us, you know, we stay aware of the things that need to be cleaned and fixed. I just enjoy um, what I do here because I am serving um, the military. Okay, so right now I am um, changing a lifeguard rotation schedule. And originally we were going to have unit training here from 12.30 to 15.30, but it looks like because today is their last day they're going to be ending early um, before our lunchtime crowd comes in. So therefore now I am changing it so that we have guards sitting stand from 12.30 to 15.30 so people can recreation and lap swim. We have to take inventory and we have to uh, count how many people are, uh, come to the pool as well as put into the computer events that go on here. I prefer being out on the deck more than the sitting in front of a computer. For every eight hour shift that we work, we're required to swim 500 meters and to log that in our book. I do enjoy it and um, you know part of it's because I, I, I think it's important to stay fit. I love being a lifeguard because I enjoy serving the military community. Just another day being a lifeguard at MCCS. Become a lifeguard just like Janie. Here are three tips to get you started with MCCS Aquatics Assistant Manager, Kimberly Yamashiro. Hi everyone, I'm Kimberly Yamashiro, Simperfit Aquatics Assistant Program Manager. And here we are today to give you three tips on how to become a lifeguard. One, register for an MCCS lifeguarding course. You can call 645-3180 at the Simperfit Aquatics main office, or you can register at any of our local swimming pools. Two, once you're registered, get certified at our local MCCS swimming pool. Tip three, don't forget to apply early online at our MCCS jobs. I hope to see you this summer on a lifeguard stand at one of our MCCS swimming pools. And now, here's your Sammy on the Street mashup. Stay cool be an MCCS lifeguard this summer. MCCS lifeguards keep you safe. Get certified. Be an MCCS lifeguard. Be an MCCS lifeguard. Come an MCCS lifeguard. Enjoy the Okinawa sunshine, get a tan, hang out with other lifeguards, swim as much as you want, and maybe save a life. You can do it as an MCCS lifeguard this summer. Get certified, sign up for a course, and thanks for watching Sammy on the Street.